Check it out. I'm going to show you how to find a center of a circle when you don't have the center itself. Now one way you could do this is just measure the diameter, but it's kind of tough to get the find the largest width of that circle to determine the diameter. You could be off a little bit. This method I'm going to show you is going to be very accurate and you don't have to guess at your measurement. So my goal here is to be able to center this plate on this piece of wood right on that dot. So I'm going to show you the steps to do that. You also might have the need for this if you happen to find a circle somewhere in your shop and you use that edge to cut a radius and you like that shape but you don't have the math or the measurement for that radius. There's another way of finding that circle so that you can actually get the radius and use it later. So the first thing I'm going to do is trace the circle. The next step is to draw a line with a straight edge anywhere through the circle. After that, you just pick a distance on your dividers or your compass and it doesn't have to be any particular distance. It's completely arbitrary and you're going to draw an arc. So you're going to put the pivot of the compass where the line cross through the circle and draw an arc there and you do another one where it crosses through the circle on the other side and you draw another arc. Then you run your straight edge through the two points of the arc strike a line. That is now a bisected circle. The next step is to draw, I'm going to make this a little larger, again completely arbitrary. Let's see where that's going to cross through, I'm going to go a little smaller. I'm going to put the pivot where the bisected line goes through the circle. I'm going to draw another arc. Do the same thing where it crosses on the other side. And now I'm going to draw a line through those. That crosshair is the center of the circle. And we can check that by putting the pivot of the compass in the crosshair and adjusting the compass to match the line. You can see it goes all the way around right on the circle. So now I can take that measurement set on my compass, place it in the center on my table, and draw my circle. And now I've located my plate exactly centered. I hope you can use that. Take it easy.